If it lands on red, we're gonna get the Oscar for this tank up here. This is really cool. These are nice little tank mates for the beta fish. Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Thanks so much for clicking and spending your time with me today. We're uploading every day on this channel. And today I have a treat for all of you guys watching. We're gonna go to the pet store and get some beta tank mates for my beta fish tanks downstairs. Those little guys need some friends downstairs. So we're gonna go to the pet store, pick out some tank mates, and I'll see you guys there. So these little neon tetras, they'll be nice. You can try three of them and see how they are and go from there. So I have a three and a half gallon. Is there nine in there? Three? Yeah. Should have a lot in the back. Those guys are a little, they're pretty too. They really pop. They haven't had babies. I've had them for a week. When, when do you think they're going to start? Can't make them I'm lighting candles up. I'm, I'm playing romantic music. It depends on them. Every once in a while they'll have babies. There's actually one in there right now. Oh, is there? Oh yeah, I see it over there. Look at that, look at that little guy. A little baby. There they go. Well, they really pop these little fish. They're really pretty. Little they neon are tetras. actually our most sellers. We got these beautiful neon tetras right here. They're gonna look so good in the beta fish tank. Look how pretty these fish are, how much they pop. So cool. Can't wait to get these home. Also, we're getting a bag of rock for the 40 gallon aquarium up in my room because we gotta set that up for the Oscar very soon. Can't wait to get that. So yeah, guys, pretty big day. This is gonna be an awesome video, guys. Stay tuned. I'll see you guys at the house. What do you think about the fish? They're adorable. Little neon tetras. So tiny. Yep, these are all of my beta fish tanks right here. If you are new to the channel, I have three and a half gallon filtered tanks for each of my beta fish right here. That's the platinum gold over there. You guys looking beautiful. If you guys want to watch like a better video like of me like explaining all these beta fish, I'll leave like a link up here. That is the gorgeous placket koi. His name is Rory. Guy is a legend. And over here is my guppy tank. I'm trying to breed some guppies over here as well. So I don't want to stress out like the beta fish because I have to acclimate this. I don't want to put like this whole bag in one of their tanks because that's going to be like crazy. Like seven little fish like swimming around in a bag that might stress out the beta. So I'm going to be putting them in the 60 gallon aquarium right here. They have plenty of room. I'm just going to close this and let these guys acclimate. Because the water is the same temperature over here. Over there, it's in the same house. Look at the crab up here doing its thing. There were some really big crabs at the pet store, and I think I wanna get like four more, because this is a big tank for like the crabs. Like this one likes to hang out up here. I might get like a little like ledge thing up here and like a suction cup and have, so the crabs can like all hang out at the top. But I definitely wanna get some more crabs. They had two really big ones at the store. So while all these cute little guys are acclimating, look, the angelfish are checking them out. <laughs> look, this one's like chasing them. So while these guys are acclimated, I actually want to show you something outside that I did today. Look at Boss. Boss is excited for what I'm about to show you guys too. Guys, literally all day today, I redid my whole backyard. If you guys remember what this looked like, like what, first of all, when we bought the house, but literally a few videos ago, it did not look anything like this. Now we have way more space. And if you guys did notice something, I set up the new pond today. Let's check this out. Oh my gosh, look how clear the water is. Literally just set this up earlier today. Can't wait to get fish in this pond very, very soon. Look how beautiful this is. This pump is insane. I have it like on the low setting right now. Let me turn it up. Let me show you guys how powerful this pump is. That's it at full blast. This thing is a monster. Oh my God, I cannot wait to get fish in this pond. Guys, what are we getting for this pond? Now we have so much more room for fish. Over here in this little mini pond over here, it's dark outside, let me get my phone. We have a few koi in here, we have a big goldfish. Maybe that goldfish should go in that big pond over there. Obviously not with the pump like that, I just wanted to show you guys. Let me know down below what we should get in this pond. I'm so excited for this. All right, so a lot of big things are coming to the channel very, very soon. So just stay tuned for that. Hopefully you guys have notifications on because YouTube does not like to send out my videos. So just hopefully you guys hit the bell and have all videos clicked so you guys get all of my videos. And I'm trying to upload every day this month, maybe even continue it. So if you guys are excited for that and do enjoy it, thanks so much for coming back every day. It really, really means a lot. Oh my God, I'm in love. I'm in love with this backyard and we're not even close to being done. Oh, and then the lady also gave us this other Tetra. It's not a neon. I forgot what it was. I forgot what she said it was, but I'm going to be putting this one in the 60 gallon because it's going to be perfectly fine. I have a bunch of Tetras in here and also some Glowfish that we just got recently, like two videos ago. What's up, buddy? Look at the angelfish. He's following me. These angelfish are so awesome. Look at this guy. He's a monster. While we're waiting for them to be acclimated, I'm also going to be bringing this up to the room. Show you, show you guys the 40 gallon. Bring this over to the 40 gallon. 
Also guys, the Glow Beta tank is doing phenomenal. Probably another day or so, and then we're gonna be getting the Beta fish for this tank. Cannot wait for that. If it lands on red, we're gonna get the Oscar for this tank up here. Ruby Red Oscar. Oh, so close. Oh, look at that. Look at that. The, the, the vent must have hit it and it landed on red. What do you know? We're getting the Ruby Red Oscar. Just shut these so there's no peepers. Oh, this is a nice little addition to the aquarium right here, right in the front. Be grateful. But yeah, guys, we have the white rock. That's what the girl suggested for this Oscar that we're going to be getting for this tank. It's really going to complement the colors on the fish. And especially right into the Scarface picture. Look at that. If you guys did forget, this thing follows me. It reminds me to always watch myself. This is a little creepy. So is that. Yo, what's good, fam? So I'm actually gonna be setting up this tank probably tomorrow because I don't wanna do this tonight. I have the neon Tetras that I just got. And also I've been working outside all day, so I'm kinda beat. So we're just gonna be putting the neon Tetras in the betta fish aquarium. And if any of the betta fish are being aggressive towards the little neon Tetras, I'm gonna be putting those in the 60 gallon aquarium. But yeah, guys, this is also coming as well. Like I said, a lot of things coming on the channel. This is gonna be so insane. Especially if you guys forgot, look how, look how awesome this is. First of all, we got the light behind the bed. That is just amazing. And then we have this right here. It's gonna be beautiful. And then also, we're gonna have another tank over there. Can't wait. I'll see you guys downstairs. All right, guys, so it's been about 20 minutes. These little minions, right, Mom? Minions. These little minions are ready to go into their new home over here. Here's the whole deal with these little guys. So the lady at the pet store said three of them have to be together so they school. So that is what we're gonna have to do. So I'm thinking that I'm gonna be putting three in this tank because there's a lot of hiding places. This beta fish really likes to hang out. You wanna come check it out for a second? <laughs> the platinum gold really likes to hang out like over here so the tetras will be able to swim around. He'll be doing his own thing over here. And then same thing goes for the placket koi. Can take that pumpkin out? No, the pumpkin's nice. This is the whole theme. All right. But what are we doing? Here, it's on Halloween. He might be a little aggressive, but if anything happens like later on, then I'm gonna be taking these guys out and putting them in the 60 What do you mean, like there. one of them gets eaten? No, not eaten, but if they get like picked on, then I'm gonna have to take them out. And they'll live a really, really good life in the 60 gallon, but... Oh, here's one of them right here. Let's get him in. He just went in. Oh, look. he's checking them out right now. Let's see what, what happens. Yeah, so he's gonna be a little aggressive at first. But let me put two more in so they feel comfortable. Yeah, no, we're gonna be able to see them when the light goes on. There goes the other one. These little fish are really cool. Here, come a little closer, check them out. Don't be shy. Here's another one. All right, let's put the lid back on so we can see it with the light. I don't know where they went. These guys are a little sneaky, these little fish. Where'd they go? Oh, they're all down here, check them out. Oh, wait, I think now he's, no. He didn't, I don't think, I think he spotted them. I think he knows that they're in there, but I don't think he knows that they're down there. But that's so cool how they're all schooling together. So, so far, so good. Really, he's, he's really not picking on them. He's not being aggressive towards them. I think he's excited that he has new tank mates, right? Look at that. He's up there, they're down here chilling. Did, did the other one go, oh, there he is. Three of them were in there? I think he put two. Oh, so let me check this out. The platinum gold is being a little aggressive They're towards the- They're staying together over there. Yeah, these guys are doing good, but, well, the pla this platinum gold over here is, he's being a little aggressive right now. He's going after No, right now, oh, he's checking them out right here. Oh, he just swam right by him, but he didn't pick at him. He's chasing them right now. So if this continues later on, because I'm going to be monitoring them later, but if this continues, then they're gonna have to go in the other tank. He was just checking them out, right? Mm -hmm. That's all he was doing. Look, now these guys are down here hanging out. They're schooling together. Yeah, awesome. We have an extra neon tetra, and we have this other tetra. I forgot Oops. what you said. <laughs> all right, watch the camera. With the, watch the camera, all right? All right, let's go over to the other tank. Let me take my little pink net. Let's go. Are you putting them in the big tank? Yeah. Oh look, awesome. Oh look, they fit right in. Look at all, look at, literally like this whole tank is Tetras now that I'm thinking about it. We have red-eyed Tetras over here, glow Tetras over here. Oh, the little neons down there, check them out. So cool. So right after I put the two fish in the 60 gallon, I realized that the neon Tetras like to be with each other. So I got the other little one out 
and now there's four in here and they're just doing great. Like I said, if anything goes on, any funny business, if you mess around with your new friends, you're gonna be in big trouble, mister. All right? Well, who's snorting like a pig in the back? Where is she? What's up, little piggy? You got groomed today? Oh, little girl, what's up? Hey, you want some camera time too? What's up, Belle? How you doing, girl? They're, I think they're all getting along. This is really cool. These are nice little tank mates for the betta fish, guys. And this is only temporary. I know you guys might say, oh, four in a tank with the betta fish and like three and a half gallons is like too small for all these fish. Very soon, I'm gonna be getting maybe a 30 gallon tank, maybe a 20 gallon and getting dividers so I can put all the betta fish in one tank. It's gonna be so awesome. I can't wait to set that up because I'm not really a fan of like all these like little different looking tanks all in my kitchen. I just, I... <laughs> 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 Always making fun of me, man. I just want all one clean tank, clean looking tank in the kitchen. So when like people walk in the house, they're gonna see the 60 gallon looking nice and natural, a clean looking tank, come over here, and then just see an, a beautiful betta fish tank all over here. Then my plan with this guppy tank, I had to unplug it because like I'm filming over here, and also the wire was like stretched back. That's what I mean. There's just like too many tanks over here, too much action going on. Like a lot of the cable management is horrendous. But this is only temporary. We're gonna do a big upgrade very soon. And then my plan with these guys, this is like the start to like the guppy breeding, but eventually I wanna get them a pond outside in the backyard. I think that's gonna be so awesome. These guys, they're gonna be living the guppy drink. Might as well do a little fishy feeding on camera. These guys gotta eat. Let's do a little sprinkle sprinkle. Oh, look at the angel fish. Shot up like a rocket. Look at all of them go. Oh, that glowfish just like chomped it. Oh my goodness, this guy's, a, this guy's a monster. Let me give them a little bit more. They need a little more. Just a little pinch more. Because the thing with this tank is like everything flows over here and then the, the filter shoots it down so everything at the bottom gets to eat as well. Well, this is a really pretty shot right here. Look at the water and the bubbles. Oh my goodness. Look, there's Molly eating. We call that fish, that big garami, Molly, named after my dog, Molly. Cause she's a chubster, right girl? Yes, you are. <laughs> glowfish, such a cool addition to the tank. Even though this is not a glow tank, definitely recommend getting some glowfish. Close that. Just shut off boss's lights. He's got bedtime right now. He's about to pass out, right buddy? Have a good sleep, man. Have a good sleep, all right? All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did make it this far, comment down below, hashtag tankmate, so I know that you made it this far so I can heart your comment. And we're gonna start something new on the channel as well. I'm gonna be giving two shout outs at the end of the video because a lot of you guys are commenting now. So the first shout out is gonna be actually the first comment. RavenYT, you commented first. So you're gonna get the shout out because you were first to the video, which is just so awesome. And also you're an OG, so thanks so much. You're the best. The next shout out is gonna be Superstar Zesh. Such a cool tank, bro, 100. Thank you so much, glad you enjoyed. The tank that you're talking about is actually this one right here. This is the Glow Beta tank. And also one last question, if you guys did enjoy like this intro and outro style when the camera's posted up right here, obviously my room is a little messy right now, but if you did like this, let me know down below because maybe I'll start throwing like these style things in like the video, I don't know. It's just an idea. So with that being said, thanks so much for watching. You guys are the best. I'll see you in tomorrow's video because we're uploading every day. And if you guys are not a part of the family yet, all you gotta do is go down below, hit the red subscribe button, make it say subscribe so you're a part of the family, the CP Army. We're also almost at 9,000 subscribers. We gained like almost 200 subscribers this week alone, which is just so nuts. Thank you guys so much for coming back every video. Love you guys and I will see you tomorrow. Peace.